hey guys, uh, this is my uh, first director's commentary. Um, this one's gonna be a little bit different because I know director's commentary start when the the film starts and then end when the film ends. But this one's crazy short and I have a lot to say. So uh, I know you're seeing a lot. Maybe you're not seeing a black screen right now. Maybe you're seeing. <laughs> maybe I'll put some clips over. Um, but yeah, this is a 48-hour film challenge. This is part of a group at the university I go to. Uh, and what they do is they give you 48 hours to do a certain challenge. Uh, so for instance, this one, we had to use a garbage bag as the prop. or And um, and the line we had to use was, you're tacky and I hate you. Which is a line I don't like, so <laughs> it definitely wasn't a prominent line if, you, if you've seen this. Um, but yeah, for only 48 hours, you know, I was really dogging on this because I didn't like it at all and then I realized I only have 48 hours to do it so I think it's fine given the time that I had to do it uh, and I was really debating on uploading this YouTube channel because I did submit it and then I was just debating uploading and I was like that's that diminishes the whole point of my YouTube channel is just to not upload it I even said I'm gonna upload bad content and bad short films and talk about what I did wrong and for this one it's just time you know 48 hours you get what you get and you gotta do it real quick um, so right when it was announced, I instantly thought suffocating someone with a garbage bag because that's that's just what I think of. That's the right thing to think of, I guess. Um, and I asked my girlfriend if she wanted to help, and she said she was fine with it, which uh, really made me really happy. Um, so yeah, uh, the, the, the there was a couple of mistakes in this, but it was like really quick fix. So at the beginning, you're supposed to see us argue, and you clearly don't see that at all. You hear it behind the door, which is clearly not us arguing because we can't scream at a college campus so you can clearly tell those are not our voices I just found some random audio uh, and inserted it and I think it works you know fine for what it is if we had more time then I could have gone somewhere and had a fake argument with my own girlfriend uh, but yeah um, so it was originally someone knocking on the door telling us to be quiet and then the beginning it just kind of seemed like a montage that was the thing I was going for but it did not work whatsoever. The first 16 seconds of this is pretty awful, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, then I think the rest of it's fine. Uh, and audio mixing I think I did pretty okay with. Um, the thing is though, you can hear the clips, you hear clipping uh, when, when I'm mixing audio and stuff, uh, which is definitely a mistake I need to work on, but I think it's good, definitely a step in the right direction because I've n audio, you know, I, this, is, this is pretty new to me. Uh, or not new to me when it comes to audio, but it's it's definitely something I'm trying to practice more at. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and start and just talk over it. Uh, I'm starting in three, two, one, and click. So yeah, like I said, uh, this shot was kind of hard to do. I was against the neighbor's door with my back was against it, so I really hope they don't see the, like a shadowy figure over it. Uh, you can clearly tell it's not our arguing either. Uh, performances wise, I thought Destiny did a fine job. There's a couple of lines from like, eh, yeah, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, me, terrible. And like I said, I don't like any of what you just first see. Uh, I'm also out of focus during that, which is fine. Uh, but I think the rest on, uh, it's definitely okay. Shot wise, it was me doing the camera work most of the time, and any shots of me is definitely Destiny doing the camera work, and I think she did a great job. Um, okay, so right here, I'm washing my hands, doing my stuff. The battery's almost dead on my camera, so I hope I can finish this real fast. Um, this is definitely a this is a definitely Joker 2019 moment. Um, I added a I had a oh I just noticed you can see the camera in the mirror. Can you? I think you can now. God, but yeah, right there where the door handle is. Uh, anyway, so that's a well. Um, uh, that's a digital zoom in on me and my really bad acting. Uh, I didn't like how I got quiet there, but I, had, I was running out of time. And then it starts back up with a low hum, which a lot of people didn't notice, which is fine. Um, but I definitely try to act as mad as possible. So the line, you're attacking, I hate you, I, the way I read that was like, that sounds like a teenage girl, like an angsty teenage girl saying that. So I was like, no, oh, Destiny can do that. So uh, yeah, I had her do that. Uh, the music I picked, I will never get this lucky music ever again. I think the music worked really, really good. Um, and I'm definitely going to reuse these for a different project, for hopefully for a better one. Uh, so yeah, I was just like, hey, can you just like talk people? Yeah, there's a line right there. Uh, I was like, can you just talk people? Uh, she was like, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, so she just kind of thought some stuff on the spot, which thank goodness, because I didn't write any of that. Uh, again, so thankful that she was able to do some camera work, because uh, she's not useful to camera, or like, she's not used to doing camera work at all. Uh, that shot was out an afterthought. I was like, oh, I got that, I'm going to get this real quick. And then, 
Yeah, I wasn't I wasn't the biggest fan of that line delivery, but I thought it was fine for what it was. Uh, for sure, I was really thankful. Uh, again, I'm really thankful for her just helping out the project in general. Uh, so there's no complaints there. And then, obviously, she was doing the camera work, so I can't actually show myself suffocating her because I just didn't want a stagnant shot because most of this has been handheld. Um, and then, oh, it's all just in his thigh. Oh, it's in his head. So, um, and I love the end credits music. I, like I said, I've gotten really lucky with music in this project. I'm definitely gonna reuse them. Uh, clearly, it's just a lot of Chase Childers and Destiny Croucher. So, um, yeah, uh, it was just us two. It would have. It was also gonna be someone else, but again, we had a, we didn't have time, and no one else wanted to help. So I was like, all right, cut the argument because it was terrible. The arguing between me and Destiny was just awful. So we cut it, and I was like, well, I'm, I still don't like the beginning of this, but. David F. Sandberg is like, it's good for what it is. You know, it's good enough. That's that's the thing he used. And I think I just need to stick with good enough for now on. Um, anywho, I really hope you liked the short film. I wasn't the biggest fan of it, uh, but the people I showed, they were they were really nice about it. Um, and uh, it generally made me feel a little better. Um, but overall, I think this is definitely not my best work. Definitely, maybe not my worst. Uh, but for 48 hours, I have to keep thinking. That's not too terrible. Uh, so yeah, leave a like, thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, uh, I'll be releasing a movie review soon, uh, it's gonna be over Soul, uh, since I watched that recently I'm late to the train, but, um, better late than never, and hopefully I'll see you guys later, peace.